Hello guys, in this video I am going to discuss about the features present in the 6.7.4.11 Chinese beta and not present in the 6.7.4.11 global beta. Basically, the features exclusive for the Chinese beta room. Starting with uh, the first, I will show you the settings that I am using, which version and why. I am using 6.7.4.11 beta update. This is the Chinese beta room. And basically, first uh, only reason I'm using it is mainly the Volti update. Volti is enabled. You can see here my Volti symbol is enabled here, and uh, the global data has not even yet given the Volti. Next, coming to the theme store. There are lot of lots and lots of themes available in the theme store. Firstly, I'll show you my themes that are already downloaded. These are the themes. And I already downloaded. Then I have the two fonts. This font I'm using currently. And then I have wallpaper, there are a lot of wallpapers which you can, you can download from the theme store. So for theme store is the best for the customization related to the line. And then we have auto watch and wallpapers, it gets refreshed every 15 minutes or every 30 minutes as per your requirements, every 3 hours or 24 hours. You can turn it on and you can use local wallpapers with Wi Fi, you can use, select all of the features. So this is the best feature, one of the best features you can say. Then we have mix and match. You can create your own custom theme, selecting all the different aspects of the theme respectively. Icons. Then we have, I'm using the custom theme which I've created just dialer. By the way, all of the details uh, I've mentioned in the my vlog, blog actually, um, which uh, links could be found in the description. Uh, whatever you want to ask, you can comment down in the below and I'll answer, try to answer them as fast as possible. So and this is the current uh, custom theme and then we have, I'll show you the theme store. This is a colorful theme store. Lots and lots of theme to your imagination. So many fonts, ringtones, wallpapers, you fall in love with the theme store, right? literally. Then we have next uh, is that, uh, one feature is that uh, you got a drive assistant enabled here. So you can see the drive assistant. I'll show you. The drive assistant is what whenever you start driving, it gets automatically enabled to playing music and all stuff. Call, declining the call automatically with the message, such things. Then next coming, we have Play Store, uh, which is fully functional in the Chinese beta also. You have really tap to install them side loaded. That's no issue. So I'll just try to install an app, Camera Ringo. Mm, and install. Let it install. Till then, we'll see what are the new features just updated. Play Store. See, you can see this is the new updated Play Store. These are the new features. It looks like this something. It's a new version Play Store. So I'll let the camera go get installed. Till then, I'll discuss the next new features. Notes. It's two new updates. That is the trash and uh, deleted notes can be found here. And another one is encrypted. So you can uh, encrypt your uh, private notes. And coming to the next feature is that music. Music has online music support that is Chinese for only for the Chinese people. See, this needs to be implemented in the global beta also. Lime, if you are seeing this video, then this is the local music apps. There's no big difference. Only the uh, the online support for the Chinese people is incredible. Uh, the online music support inbuilt, like the Google Play Music you have in Android. Security app basically is the same, there is no big difference, but only the data server feature is missing in the Chinese beta. Weather app is revamped and superb, cool looking, new transition and animations are superb according to the climate. Um, one of the best features of the prime, you can say. Coming next, we have toolbox. The toolbox on the major update is this dice feature, which was not present in the beta update. You can do up to six dice at a time, that's main the compass and all are working, same stuff. There is no big change. And then we have the calculator. Calculator, you can see we have housing loans, then we have income tax, then we have currency and all the basic stuff. Newer calculator have all the basics. Then coming to the gallery, it has got this cloud backup system. Important update. Then next we have the file manager. We have the recent tab added to the file manager. Then the dialer we have the yellow pages. See, basically, what is this? It gives details about the numbers of travel agencies, hotels, food, nearer area, but it is only for the Chinese people, not for global beta persons. That's what I'm saying. Also, feature web call, unlimited history calls, etc. calls only in China present, uh, presently. 
flash on alert this is a feature number identifier speed dial voice messages enabled uh, you can save voice messages and uh, to send it to everyone automatically as it you do not answer a call next feature is user account here we have data sync home screen backup phone finder all of them enabled in the chinese only chinese beta not in the global beta that's the basic uh, friends in that then in the data sync also we have time machine where you can recover your deleted contacts sms etc by mistake if you have deleted it then uh, download it again and restore it to your account and this is the important update and this is all missing actually uh, in the global beta see it's enabled here then we have the recycle bin just like the recycle bin of the desktops and pcs which you by which you can restore all the data the uh, sms's and notes and what not then we have many useful apps such as a smart voice assistant and all but these are basically in china and literally i don't know how to use it uh, many others many others almost nine of them see place record install so place one actually works fine and all of the other apps then mix player and all other apps work superb no issues and then we have task manager and service history these are two of the features which i need to discuss all of them installed and the uh, task manager is super fluent one RAM management is superb in this. And then lastly, I'll discuss about the uh, language input and the uh, the system keyboard. System keyboard is one of the best features. It is a new updated system keyboard. You get lots and lots of emojis and all of them. And lots and lots of emojis, emotions. Then lastly, we have uh, service history. Here you can know about your service details. When you have service and why, uh, according to your uh, details of the location, the customer uh, center, service center, and all hotline, mail, WeChat, etc. And contact them. Um, and I would like to conclude the video and say that if you like the video, please share with your friends, like, and to subscribe. And for all more details, visit my blog. Links will be in the description. Thank you.